throwing ad libs the I've whole had time. A lot of coffee, so Ooh, this mama. Might be hey, <laughs> hey, <Ooh. laughs> they're really mama. just like, no, yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> say mama again, say mama, mama, <laughs> <laughs> mama. That's so weird. I listen to a lot of Takeoff. <laughs> Take off. Take off. <laughs> oh, oh. Sada Canadian. Oh, shit. Bam. Fresh out the band. He sounds Fresh more Canadian than anyone else. Take off, eh? Trip. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> grandma. 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 Great grandma. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, welcome back to the podcast, Cameron Do Thing. Brian, you ready? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Okay. okay. Hey. Uh, I just got a notification on my motherfucking phone. Notice. It's your mama asking me where the fuck I put her drone at. It's uh-huh. weird your mom's got a drone. I'm about to smoke this blunt and not uh-huh. care about your mama no more because that's all I have to say. And it's not runs, but it's not um, runs. But it's a blunt. But it's a blunt. But it's a blunt. Oh, that was that. Shit. That's me throwing ad libs the whole time. <laughs> that was a lot of. Uh, hey yo, caffeine. uh, welcome back to the podcast, Beanie Boys Being Blunt, where yeah. we smoke a blunt, we be blunt. It lasts as long as a blunt. My name's Thad Spark B. Bam, 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 bam. I am your co-host, the other co-host of the evening or yep. morning, whatever the fuck we're in. Good afternoon, uh, Cameron Good Kenzie. That's me. We got Joe Bruno on the ones and twos today. JB. No, making it sound good. And then we got uh, Brian and Larray sitting in. Brian today. and Larray sitting on and the Jay. couch today. What Jay's up? here too. What up, Jay's Jay? Over there. Jay, folks, just sitting in the corner. Um, like but before we get this thing started, Big it's, Jay Okerson. It's uh, you know, you know what time it is. It's time for new jokes. Ah, uh, yeah. What? This is time for new jokes. Uh-huh. 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 That's my favorite. It's my yeah, that's favorite. That's pretty good. That's my All right. favorite. Uh, you sparked it. You're fine. We're going to flip this coin. I'll be tails. You'll be heads. As usual. I'll be heads. You'll be tails. That's the why, exact why same Why do you got to make it sexual, Dad? Because that's how it started. <laughs> oh, you dropped the goddamn coin. <laughs> it's not a, the technique's not there. No. This is it was wild. not my best flip, okay? <laughs> it's, it's tails. Oh, it's me. Uh, I get to play host for the evening. Um, <laughs> keep it going for that last guy, Jay. He looks like my 2K player. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that is racist. Why That's is really funny. <laughs> dark, dark skinned and everything. Um, <laughs> Yo, well, no. <laughs> your 2K character got no VC. I <laughs> yeah. Well, here's a no. He, he skipped through the tutorial and you couldn't change the player and you just got stuck. <laughs> yeah, with dude. Like yeah. I, I, just pressed, I pressed A too many times <laughs> and I got J. So. Go straight to the draft. Randomize. Uh, randomize. Coming up next. Randomized. Local killer, national phenomenon. Yikes. Um, coming all the way from Canada. Mm-hmm. Uh, what city? <laughs> uh, New Market. New Market, Canada. That's where Jim Carrey Y'all was put born. your hands together for my good friend Cameron McKenzie. Yay! Yay. Thank you very much, Thad. Um, Brought the energy as always. I got dude always. Yeah, you're a, the most energetic comic in town. Um, I came up with a new restaurant idea. It's for aliens called Cumin Peas. Ah, uh, that's fucking stupid. <laughs> Weed is crazy. I hate coughing. Like coughing is my <laughs> least favorite thing to do and no one should be coughing. If we if you take weed out of the equation of what we're doing <laughs> right here, we're just coughing through conversation. That's fucking stupid. But if you don't cough, you don't get off. So like <laughs> like we all cough and go, Facts, Nice, dude. he did it. My stepdad's a doc, a doctor, and he's really concerned in my house about how much I cough, and I'm trying not to smoke weed around him. Do you actually have like respiratory issues though? Not right now. Oh, that's good. Was the premise of that joke that you live with your parents? Yeah, and I don't like coughing. Don't ask it on there, Brian. There's an ashtray. There's an ashtray. Oh, there's not really a premise of that joke. These are new jokes. Like I haven't come up with half of these. Uh, there's a lot of people that are sus in this world. One hundred percent. I tell you what. There's a lot of sus people. Um, I think the most that I have learned recently is people who kiss their parents on the mouth after age five. Like, I can't. <laughs> in public. Like, I, I work at a deli, and there's a lot of families that come in, and, like, they meet up for lunch, and their daughter will be kissing daddy on the mouth, and she's, like, 15 and a half. Yeah, that's sick. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's fucked yeah. up. That's like, I, didn't, I don't think I've ever kissed my parents. My mom tried to kiss me on the mouth. I slapped her in the mouth. No! <laughs> I'm saving it till marriage. You put your finger on her lips like, no. No. <laughs> These lips are for the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's funny. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh. Mm-hmm. Whenever I go out to eat, um, people, like, really talk to me. Like, the host will, like, really 
have a good conversation. The waitress or waiter will be like really interested in conversation. Bartender is all, always really nice. But I work in customer service. I'm only nice to people who are attractive. Am I like pretty? You're beautiful. Am I cute or funny? Because that's a struggle I've been trying to. It, do I just make funny sounds come out of my mouth or do people like looking at my face? I think you're beautiful. I know what you think. They're probably just thinking like, man, if I could clean this guy up. <laughs> I could fix him. Yeah. Yeah. There, I'm a fixer upper. I'm like yeah. a bad piece you of got property. A lot of potential. I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot of potential. <laughs> they just see the potential. That's yeah. all it is. They're Bitches just trying love to help potential. Me. That's, <laughs> that's <laughs> one thing we love is yeah. potential. Ooh, yeah, I see. You love. That's funny. Bitches love potential. Is that my light? All right, cool. I got one more. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> in your face. <laughs> right in your hey, face. Like, hey, nigga. Wrap uh, that shit up. That's your time, dude. That's I uh, <laughs> I look like Mr. Pringle before capitalism. Thank you. I have been. <laughs> I, love it. I love that. That's a do good slut one. Joke. Do slut joke. Close on slut joke. Uh, you ever see a slut and you're like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Cameron McKenzie, everybody. Those are new crappy jokes. Those weren't bad, though. No, they were all right. <laughs> Did Joe hit that? Did y'all pass out to Joe back there? Oh, I didn't it? know he was smoking. You're good? Sorry. <laughs> it's too early in the morning. I'm sorry. He looked like he hyped, though. He just woke yeah, up. we're recording yeah. this in the a.m. But Joe, it's actually a said, Joe actually said one thing one time. He said, I'm actually not high all the time. I just got, like, work to do, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're, you're the like, one that's... telling people not to do drugs while you're at work. That's Joe Facts. Bruno as hell, man. Yeah, but he looks like the biggest, like, druggie of all time. And that's not an insult. You just look seasoned yeah, dude. in the you drug just war. Look, you look like you know what you're doing like at a festival, you know? <laughs> yeah. You're at home at festivals. <laughs> like, if I got lost and saw you at a festival, I'd be like, oh, this is a wook Be like, that he I could point me with. to where I could go. Yeah. <laughs> that's a wook I could trust. <laughs> yeah. That's a wook I could trust right there. Word. <laughs> we're co- we're recording he this in the morning, though. 36 is. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. 35, 35 through 1. He can get you to all of them. Uh, um, we're doing this in the morning because we got people from out of town. Morning time. Lorraine and Brian, how are you guys doing? Yeah, we got what's Brian up? Sullivan and Lorraine. Yeah, what's up? Yeah. Lorraine, all the way from Atlanta. Yeah. Uh, hey, ATL. Yeah. ATL. Sad has a question for you guys. I do. We don't mean it as an insult. And it's never an insult. Um, mm-hmm. It's just a little harsh. What the fuck do you guys do, man? Yeah, what the fuck? Shit. What, in Atlanta? Shit. <laughs> just whatever you want. Just, <laughs> just what do we Lorraine, do? what do you do? Brian, we know what you do a bit. Yeah. You're our friend. You're a homie. We see you all the time. You're a comedian, local comic, local Brian's entrepreneur. Brian's the first two-timer on this podcast, actually. Yeah. He oh, is. Yeah, back to back. Yes. Yeah. Two-timer. Yeah. 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 But Lorraine, what the, the what the fuck do you do? For me, uh, <laughs> in general, I'm just constantly trying to achieve the most with the least output. I love that answer. Laziness dude. is next to godliness. Hell yeah. For me. Dude. I <laughs> but I feel like that's how it should be done. That's the most efficient way possible. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's yeah. pretty much what Works like, smarter, not harder. That's, you want, <laughs> that's what you want out of a car, too. You're like, don't work too hard, but get me where I need to exactly. be. That's why you see a lot of Toyota Camrys on the road. You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I always felt like people that buy Camrys are like some of the worst drivers ever. 100%. Because <laughs> they're so just it's bad. Like there's like something there. They're the, they're always in the right think lane. Who's what's like the main demographic of a Camry driver? Karens, uh, single mom, single mom, Karens and Camrys. No, no I was gonna mom. say no, I was like, like uh, I was IT a lot worker. Of teenagers I was gonna say them. dudes like me, dude, that are it's just like still on our first car. Yeah, like ninety three Camry, that shit runs forever. Oh, yeah. okay. If we're talking nineties Camrys, those are different. Yeah. I'm talking like someone who drives a new Camry now. Yeah, yes. like a why would you buy? Like, I could never well, put I'll, myself in that mind frame where I would buy a fucking Camry. If you're gonna buy a new car, it's not all the new cars. I I think it's weird when people buy a new. Honda Accord. I'm yeah. like, stick to you like 2006. Yeah. I love Honda Accord. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they've won that award They're or whatever. They're so dependable. <laughs> to be and honest. they get more sporty every year. I had a 94, and did you know that one in every <laughs> six, one in like every six keys, if it's made before Sponsored 94? Sponsored by Bro. Honda, Honda Accord. Please. You can no. steal Hondas easy. Shout out to Honda. Book me on other commercial motherfuckers. Yo, Joe Bruno. I'm not telling y'all what to do, but like Honda Accords are easy to break into if they're made before 97. I'm not telling you what to do. One in six keys can get in any one. But somebody already broke into my Honda Accord. So <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you get one stolen too? No, I didn't get it stolen. Oh, mine did. They um, just busted my window out and then decided like they hit me with the Play-Doh's closet treatment. They didn't even oh. take shit. Like, they, were like, oh. they just looked through? Yeah, they rifled. Okay. I hate that. I Wrong hate when they car, go through my, my CDs. Bad. <laughs> 
That's fucked up. A nigga break into your car, you're like, ah, actually. I thought okay. this was They've the organized suburban my next to it. Dash, they organized my seat one time. They had, like, oh, wow. stuff everywhere, and they were like, I'm going to go through these CDs and make this a little better for them. I had some fake-ass Beats by Dre in the car, some Amazon. Oh, yeah. They saw right that, through them. They, they tried they them on and everything. No, they did take those. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. So that they probably made me flipped feel them. Like yeah, you were like, yeah, there. fuck yeah, you took some. Yeah. Right out the Camry. That's crazy. You guys, I got robbed. <laughs> <laughs> I have nice shit. I got my shit, shit taken hey, away. I got, well, I don't know if I got robbed as much as rifled through. I don't yeah. know. That's a violation. It's a violation. Um, it is. A violation. LeRae, you do comedy down in Atlanta? I do do comedy What? In tell Atlanta. us about that. What's it like? What's oh, the is that what you were asking earlier? I thought you just meant in general, like... What do you do? Oh, well, that is yeah. also the question. Is what you, you can answer it however you want. Yeah, I do. I do stand up comedy. You know what Fuck I mean? Yeah. Um, I try to make funny videos. Mm. Um, hilarious. Like Her reaction TikTok videos. Is, Her TikTok is crazy, bro. No, I kind of just be talking. Okay. You know what I mean? Like yeah. every every now and then, I just wake up and I'm like, this. You know, this is a thought that's gonna rock the fucking world. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me. I get that. Lorraine. Yeah. Bitch. You know what I mean? That's <laughs> how I like it. You know what I mean? Like, Yo. I'm trying to tell y'all. You know what I'm saying? And it's so funny seeing the shit that, like, blows up. Like, one time I was literally just sitting there thinking, like, you know, the older you get, the more careful you have to be about having who you have your kids with. Because, like, I'm in my 30s. If I have a dumbass baby daddy, ain't nobody gonna forgive me for that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, bitch, you're old as fuck. You have too much time under your belt for that. And I just yeah. put that on TikTok, and that shit just went nuts. Like, <laughs> and everybody was like, yeah, yeah. she's so right. You know what? <laughs> All these 34 year old men were like, I am not sleeping with him anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care that his dick is fire. He can't spell. People forgive you for terrible baby daddies when you're young, but yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So, anyways, yeah. Um, I've been making videos. I've been, you know, I do the improv. Two, out of the two, like making videos, the social media based side of comedy or the live stand up side of comedy, which one are we taking? Gun to your head. Damn. Gun uh, to your head. Why do you have to get head? so violent? Knife to the stomach. Oh, <laughs> that's, that's scary. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. Really Still scary. not as progressive. Watch yeah. out for that tummy knife. <laughs> I feel like the knife to the stomach. I definitely feel more. like, you know, live stand up, like there's no feeling like that. Like, no. you know, mm-hmm. um, yeah. Like, yeah, that it's too hard to achieve. If it's you like, you can't. If, you can't if, find that. if you did stand up comedy for the first time and like you felt that feeling, then now it's just you know you have to fucking mm-hmm. do it. You oh, always yeah. have to. The do first it. time you get that eruption, like a whole Dude, audience yeah. just yeah. like yeah. I just it made is. all of you laugh at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. you know how dumb that was. Yeah. Yeah. That's stooge. a drug. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm cool. a stooge and like a magician yeah, though. Brian, what about you? You say stand up comedy too? Stand up comedy, yeah. Just because I suck at the internet. Brian, we never, we didn't talk about it when you were uh, on the podcast. How long have you been doing it? I've been doing this almost four years now, bro. Hey, wow! It'll be four years in November. Congrats! Shout Shout out! Hell yeah! Four years. Four years. Four Four years in. What do you think? Uh, it's fucking wild. Four years in. <laughs> what do you think? If you go, listen. It's if, college. You're four years in, young if you man. Do, if you go do stand up comedy for like <laughs> senior year. Yeah, dog. I'm finna graduate, go get my masters. You know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, snap. I'm finna, you know. But you're like, not going to you get go, your doctorate? You, do this shit, you gotta like really dedicate yourself yeah. to it. Yeah. You feel mm-hmm. Because like, it's a lot of shit that goes into just doing comedy or putting together a comedy show. Or, well, it's you know all it's like, all the time. It's something like you can you, constantly be you, writing, you can constantly be planning mm-hmm. stuff. You can't stop thinking about it. No, like, it's always, insane. Steve Martin always said, always be thinking about the bit. You feel me? Always think about the yeah. bit, bro. Yeah. Like, even natural conversation yeah. and all yeah. that. Yeah. I get but that. It's like, it's very hard. It's a lot of bullshit that you go through. It's a lot of politicking that you have to do. Mm. It's a lot of like elbow I'll politic rubbing. you, you some bitch. You feel me? Yeah. <laughs> Like, I'll politic you, but I'm actually Shout like out brother I'm that. actually impressed by you two the way that y'all have been. You know what I'm saying? Moving. Hey, thanks, yeah, man. You know what I'm saying like it's I think it's because this you kid started younger. To people like you. No, yeah, that was God. sweet. You started young, like. Uh, I start. My first time was when I was 19. Yeah, and then I'm That's 29, so like I, I, I waited. I actually seen Thad's yeah. first set. My first ever. That's set. crazy. And it was yeah. at Looney's in front of a. That was my house. second one. Oh. That was when you had you was long hair thad. Yeah, he was Indian thad. I was uh I was long hair thad for the first one too. I used to have long, we used to look we still all kind of look the same. Me and thad look the same through the years. Like I had long hair, he had long hair. So let me we ask you a question. Man. What's up? How much has it changed since y'all started? And y'all have been oh. doing it what two years, two three years? Yeah, just a two, just about two. Like it's three, changed pretty three in total, but like a year and a half like Actual. doing Consistent. it. Yeah. Um, it's crazy. We talk about it a lot. Yeah, it's, it's just. Nuts. 
I, it's not what I thought it would be for sure. Like, well, cause when I first started, I was a dumbass and I was like, dude, yeah, I have a five minute set now. I'm going to be on Netflix in two weeks. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And then they're calling. Yeah. Shout out to Kobe Carlson. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You caught that. Syndrome. Well, that's legit what I was like thinking yeah. at 19 though too. And then I started doing it like consistently and I was like, holy shit, this is going to take a lot longer than I yeah, thought. Yeah. It's hard. Yeah. It, like, what was it like when you, when you got to watch someone who really does this shit? Like, oh, it was crazy. For the first time. That was crazy too. Because it was just at an open mic too, yeah. and then that's when I realized I was yeah. like, "Oh, every you just have to like get up." And I like, felt tell like that. Uh, I saw Mike Hammock because the first time I did a club open mic was there, and you saw it. I yeah. think you were there, and Mike Hammock brought me up, and I watched him like open up, and I was like, "Holy shit, that guy's <laughs> he's a professional!" Yeah, I was like, no, that's like crazy. Crazy. Yeah. And then I went out and, and did just, my shit. Yeah, and then he was like, "That was great. How long you been doing this?" I was like, "Not that fucking long." Yeah. He was like, "Shit, bro." Yeah. Like, cool. yeah. that, like it feels cool because I came in on the opposite end, like thinking I am nothing. I'm just gonna get up there and tell jokes and hope they like it. Same. Like I and I still kind of feel that way. Yeah. I was nervous as shit my first time though too. Yeah. But do you get the poops? Do you get like pre poops? No, but it was like I get pre poops. It was to yeah. the point where like I thought I was gonna throw up, and I haven't done that <laughs> like ever. But I was like, holy shit, they're all gonna be watching me. This is terrible. Yeah. I used to do that me. when I did theater. Yeah. I used to puke off stage. And that I was be the like, other ah! crazy thing is line. like thinking about when i first started and how i didn't want anybody to be there i was like I yeah hope nobody i did my first time that. yeah Same. And nobody knew and now mm -hmm. and now i'm like i want fucking 600 people dude. yeah i'm like <laughs> I, want, I want the whole come. city to come and see this at the same you want time. you want to know like the crazy part is when like you first start everyone's so supportive like yeah i'm gonna come oh yeah, come. yeah. they come and to then, the first three yeah, or four dude. and then you finally get on some big big shit and they're like oh yeah well we've seen yeah already. Lorraine, I'm how like, long no, you have it <laughs> how long have you been doing it, Lorraine? I think about five years. Five nice. years now? Yeah, about five. Five years in. What do you think? Five years in. Like, <laughs> you just graduated <laughs> school. How are you feeling in the real the world? for the master's right We're now. all babies in this shit. Yeah, 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 for sure. Like, I mean, five years in, I still feel good about it. I still feel like it's what I'm, you know, I'm supposed to be doing it or whatever. But yeah. I just am like, damn, I need to get my I need to get my Instagram and my TikTok up. Because, mm. like, That's I feel the way like it's going, it used sure. to be like, I mean, there's two ways. Um, there's two ways to do comedy. Either you're going to tour for 10 years, you know what I'm saying? Just yeah, be a road driving dog. to Omaha, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, or whatever, shout out but, to Moyne. Um, or you're going to get crazy <laughs> followers online and they're going to be like, oh, you can put asses in seats? Cool. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like, Which is so. weird. It's They're both weird. Yeah. Like they're both the craziest thing you could yeah. do with your time. Yeah. But like I, I don't think any of us think about that. I didn't think about how often I spent doing comedy and like preparing for stuff until someone was like, you do this shit every night. You're at a show. You're writing something. Well, most you're of the time, me jokes, and I'm like, "Oh yeah, I'm addicted to the hang now, dude. <laughs> yeah. Oh I'm yeah, yeah. I'm what? addicted right, to the fucking right, hang. Right, yeah, right. well, because it's like I'll just the go club to is a the show. best bar in yeah. town, yeah. like it, because it's all your homies, and you all get it. Because yeah. there's that camaraderie of, oh, we all get up there and say dumb shit. Yeah, yeah. I always feel like you know, even when I'm not like sometimes I'm not in the mood to tell jokes, mm -hmm. or like I feel like, oh, I. I'm trying to write, but I'm like, I have no inspiration. Sometimes you just need to be around funny motherfuckers. Like yeah, sometimes yeah. you just need to be, and that's the great thing about um, discovering your passion is like having that outlet. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Even if I'm not going to go and I'm not going to get up, I'm going to go see people doing yeah. what I want to do. Like, you know what I and mean? Then, and then you know where to find everybody that shares the same passion too. Yeah. Right, like right. they're at the comedy show. And I'm that's a big, like that's a big yeah. thing. Cause there's so many people that like, not to get too deep, but like there's so many deep. people, people that just going through life and yeah. they have, no passion they just fucking go to work yeah. before yeah. i started comedy i remember that like going to work and, and feeling like a bum i felt like a bum even mm -hmm. though i wasn't a bum but i wasn't doing anything with my it. creativity you know mm -hmm. what i mean yeah it's bumming it and slumming it yeah just working and that's working it, like know? a bum dog million like a cornball you know what i'm saying like <laughs> yeah. that's so fucking corny you just have a job ew yeah. <laughs> <laughs> word yeah. uh loray do you have a new joke for us she is. She. I um. <laughs> Hit us with that wire. Shit. I watch. I've, I've been watching. You know, I'm on TikTok a lot, and okay. I feel like they're starting to make me think I'm autistic. <laughs> <laughs> like, they, like hold on i mean i'm i'm but it's like cool. you're starting to rethink everything i kind of want to know if i am if i'm on the spectrum but like that's a lot of copays <laughs> 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 do you know how long they're gonna draw that shit out yeah they're gonna it's like, for so, a lot of like copays. So, yeah but i do feel like being on the spectrum is kind of dope, though, actually. <laughs> I mean, because you get to be, like, brutally honest, and everybody's like, 
She just doesn't know. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like yeah. it's just who she is. Yeah. But they also always have like a special power. That shit's kinda cool. Like What you do know, you want yours to be? Well, that's <laughs> what I was thinking. Like, what would, would you rather <laughs> be able to recall the top five R and B chart from nineteen ninety seven? Okay. Or make eye contact with people. Oh <laughs> yeah. that's a really good point. I don't know. Nineteen ninety seven was a really good year for R and B. Exactly. R&B. It's so, not hard. You know, I've seen enough eyes. Exactly. I've seen so. enough eyes. That's something okay. I'm working that's on. That's a good joke. Oh, yeah, that's good. Lorraine. Lorraine, give Lorraine. it up for Lorraine. 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 Uh, your next up, comic, Brian? a Brian Sullivan. You got a joke we haven't heard? I don't. You don't have anything? Don't have Nothing anything. off you the cuff? You don't have one? Huh? You don't have one? I got it. I got something. Just something that me and Dad haven't heard. That's about I'm only doing three. Yeah. I watch a lot of porn. You know what I'm saying? Like, holy <laughs> shit! I like watching porn, but I hate talking about porn with people. You feel me? Because like, I was at the barber shop the other day, and my my barber was like, "Yo, man, you you seen this porn star X, Y, and Z?" And like, right when you say that you like a porn star that I like, it ruins it for me. Oh yeah, because yeah, then you're gonna think of them. Because like when that's I, my porn star. Yeah, she's like, mine. <laughs> I found that on my own. I don't, don't want to think about my barber when I'm about to nut. You know what I'm saying? I get it. <laughs> yeah. Unless you're looking in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. And then, That's funny. Uh, yeah. I uh, like that. I like yeah, that because the, like I don't like that either. Yeah. I don't cool. like a people. I'm like, no, you don't know them. Yeah, bro. It's yeah, cool. come down. Fucks me up. <laughs> <laughs> also, the, yeah. the owner of Yu-Gi-Oh died. And Rip. It makes me think oh, about it all you. the fucking time. You know what I'm saying? Cause like, I, I was too broke to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, the starter pack was like thirty nine ninety nine. I feel mm-hmm. that. And like, my mama said, we got way better shit to spend $40 on. Mm-hmm. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but she was like, you know what? I know you signed up for that tournament. I'm going to take you because we follow through. But if they give you any trouble, you play this card. She gave me her EBT card to play. <laughs> <laughs> And it was dope. They invited me back because I bought snacks for everybody. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. You didn't have to send anybody to the shadow <laughs> realm, bro. Uh, one day I want you to get on stage. I just can't like send you, you to the right shadow realm, but I can get you to 7 Eleven. You know what I'm saying? There you yeah. go. Yeah. He's so relaxed like, saying it, too. Yeah, that's funny. You should go on just <laughs> like that. Sit uh, on the stool and just be like, I'm Ryan Sullivan. <laughs> All right. As, as y'all know, that's totally the opposite of me. Oh, yeah. we know. <laughs> when you come down in this basement, it's like, where did Brian go? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Inside voice. Give it up for your last comic, Brian Sullivan. It's time for new jokes Woo. one more time, God damn it. Uh, Fatty Daddy's that. been skirting this one for a long time because, you know, last week he had to write or he had to read that you look like so I wrote about him because oh, he, yeah. he didn't write jokes. This oh, are yeah. your jokes. Hold on real quick before you start this, man. Shout What's out up? to Cameron McKenzie. Oh. Back to oh. back. Two, two time. time. Big Cam. Two, two time. time. You look like champion, man. I was. Whoosh, whoosh. It was dope to see you, bro. Was, yeah. We did You Look Like two in time. fucking Atlanta and that shit was, yeah. like, that shit was fun as fuck. Yeah. So like I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do like a a battle of champions. Oh, so basically fucking, take yeah. the champ from the one I did in Florida, bring the one from Atlanta, and hell yeah, it's like a I'm uh, gonna have y'all battle it out. It's like a uh, national karate tournament, but yeah. with you look like. Yeah. Can we all dress in like different jackets yeah. and stuff? Who's gonna reign supreme? Oh, big you know? Cam. Y'all so better believe it. You earned it, big Cam. Hey, thank but you. now you got John Rummery, so I'm no, excited. Fine. He's easy peasy. Hell yeah, John. You see this? Yeah. Fuck him up. He looks like split pea soup. All right. Uh, give it up for fucking Thad B, baby. Let's hear these jokes, kid. No pressure. Hey, I'm Thad B. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was the first one. Um, I'm Indian. Sometimes people think I'm black, which is pretty cool. Unless it's a cop, and then it's not that cool, you know? <laughs> but I totally, I get the correlation between cops and colored people, you know? I'm a, you're a pig, I have pigmentation, you know? You uh. can't spell one without the other. Ah, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> I get it, I get That's it. good. No, so, oh, yeah, 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 I added a tag to this one. No, um, so, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Wait, how's it go? Oh, yeah. <laughs> No, sometimes sometimes people do think I'm black. Like when I show up to the park and they're playing pickup basketball, they're like, "Yo, get the light skinned kid," and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> "It's the face." Excuse me. Yeah, excuse me. Yeah, there you go. There, there you go. go. Smize. I go. Smize. I can go full light skinned face. There we go. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> the ha. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> <laughs> I get waves out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> but then I start shooting the basketball, and they're like, oh, no, he's just brown. <laughs> I just went from Tupac to Tupacistani so fucking fast. That's, funny. That's silly. That was the tag. That's silly. That's um. Silly. Okay. One more. I I also watch porn, which is crazy. Um. <laughs> uh. Thanks. Oh, let me get out of here with this one, guys. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh. I watch porn. I did virtual reality porn the other day, which was pretty cool. Um. <laughs> Like, no, it is like you throw the goggles on and like I woke up and it was a super nice room and I was like, this is cool. But then I looked down and I had a white fucking dick, dude. And (laughs) it freaked me out. You know, I don't know if you've ever had a white dick before, but it's not the dick you want to have. Okay. (laughs) Hey, shit looked like a fucking bubblegum lollipop. It just long white shaft and a bright pink head. (laughs) It's curving the wrong way, too. I thought he was left handed or something. It was freaking me out. (laughs) <laughs> and then I realized I was on the casting couch. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I think it was you might have been watching my dick. Holy shit. I'm Did white. Did I just describe Dad. it? I don't know, maybe. You could you could say like it looked like I was looking at a feeder mouse. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 I, I hate get, that equivalent. <laughs> Um, That's but yeah, funny. I'm Thad. I'm th- th- hey, give it up for Thad. <laughs> Those are his <laughs> new <laughs> jokes. <laughs> Look at Jake Vanderwall Jake sitting Vanderwall, over there laughing dude. in his fucking James Harden golf shoes over right, there, exactly. piece of shit. <laughs> Jake, um, Jake looks like he's about to uh, buy the rights to this podcast. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> You're going to take a lot of money from us right now. <laughs> yeah, you shaved your mustache a little bit, so now I can see you do have an upper He's lip, actually so about nice. to Wayne's world us right yeah. now. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. Actually, yeah. We'll start wearing full Pepsi outfits. Can I buy you guys? <laughs> <laughs> we don't like sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this? Bro, you gonna get us, bro, you gonna get us taken down, bro? Beans. No, don't worry about it. We don't have enough viewers right now for that. Uh, <laughs> to be blunt, if one of the, if one of the knows. twenty viewers works for them or works for the rival company, yeah, they deserve Hit us to up. shut we us could be, down. We could be the thing is, I never realized that they were putting beans in tomato sauce. That's whack, isn't yeah. it? I don't like that. <laughs> That's what it is. It's wacky. Look at it. That's some wacky says. beans. <laughs> <laughs> Those are wacky, wacky beans. beans. Pork and beans. on a beat. Yo. Pork <laughs> and beans. Oh, and oh and that's beans. been a podcast. Hey, hey, hey follow hey, these guys on guys. social yes. media. Underscore we'll plug Brian it in the bios. Brian the Lion. That's a podcast. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Oh, if y'all are got ever a in Atlanta, can of beans. We'll bring them up. to Atlanta. Yeah, we'll yeah. go down and see Lorraine and have a fun time out yeah. there. It's real hot down yeah. there. It's kind of muggy. It snows a lot. That's not very true. It actually rains and it's kind of wet. Like your mama was last night when I fed her these beans and tomato sauce. Hey, <laughs> hey <laughs> damn. I'll give her that six grams of protein <laughs> per serving. <laughs> Sticky. Yeah. Next year, right. like August 25th. Come see us, bro. Come see Camden. Yeah, time, three man. times, bitch. I'm going to Bill Russell this shit. Get enough rings. That also shout out to Thad's best. You look like joke. You look like. You support Black Lives Matter because your feet are dark. That's, <laughs> <laughs> That's been a podcast. Ah! That's been a podcast. Fuck off. He's racist, you guys. Just- <laughs> <laughs>